this Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Duel Academy. Welcome back to school, guys. Sitting by the setting sun, fishing, chilling out with the crew in the schoolyard, enjoying the sunsets, and watching the boats pass by. episode I think we just did like a couple things by mail right and that was basically it uh, so yeah in this episode we're gonna continue here oh we have someone here at night okay it's G let's do it hey class showed up let's do this I've been waiting for the stool a long time yeah get your game on <laughs> all right then we will go Giant red at you, Jaden. That's it. Let's see what you've got. Get your game on. It's my turn, so I draw. Alright. I'm gonna summon Luster Dragon in attack mode. Oh, that's new. Not playing sky Skyscraper for sure. Sorry, Flood, but Luster Dragon's gonna attack Giant Red. Indeed, so it is, Jaden. But that's what I wanted, because now I can special summon little friend I like to call Nima Momoga. Hmm, one face down, huh? Well, we can wipe that face down off the map if I want to. I think I'll wait till he plays Skyscraper to Heavy Storm. Or a couple more. I'm actually gonna set Nimmo Momoga to defense, just in case here. Uh, Lester Dragon. Yeah, 1900's pretty good, Jaden. But what do you think about this? I summon Steamroid in attack mode. And when this engine gets rolling, it's got a little heat. Because when my steamroid attacks, well then, oh, negate attack. Hmm. Interesting move, Jaden. Interesting move. Hmm. Let's play swords to protect steamroid. Because when it gets attacked, it loses 500, so. All right, Jaden, you got me there. You're up. Sakuretsu armor. We don't really need to set this since uh, I've got swords at the moment. Hmm, maybe I should go for the flip effect on Slate Warrior. Uh, let's attack first. Let's attack first. Let's see if you've got a mirror force, Jaden. Oops! I did not mean to attack that one. Okay, well, he played the trap anyway. Magic cylinder! Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Alright, Jaden. Alright. Hmm. Maybe I should throw my Nimmo Manga into his Luster Dragon, just so I suppose the other two out. Uh, yeah. You know what, we have swords anyway. Let's uh, set up the Slate Warrior combo. Hmm. Ah, no face downs this time, Jaden. Alright, good, we didn't draw into a Nimmo Manga. Alright, I flip some Slate Warrior. <laughs> and this monster's gonna scrape all of yours off the pavement. Because whenever I flip it face up with its flip effect, well then, it gains 500 attack and defense points. Alright, battle phase time. Nemo Manga, throw yourself into that luster dragon. I know it seems like a reckless move, but trust me, Drayden, I've got a strategy. Because now I'll gain a thousand, and I'll set two Nemo Mamongas on my field. <laughs> Alright. Like I said, this engine's got some heat, because when it attacks a monster, well then, it gains 500 points. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry, Luster Dragon. Alright, and Slate Warrior's gonna scrape this monster off the pavement. Go, new punch! Oh, it was Spear Dragon. Wow. Well, I guess he couldn't attack. I did have swords, so... Wow. Alright, I'm gonna 
gonna set a few cards. Why is it playing the winning duel music? I'm losing. What? I'm losing by 1800 points. We're winning a duel. Yeah. Do, 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 do. We're winning a duel. We're winning a duel. Like, why is it playing this? What? <laughs> Maybe the game knows Jane Bright. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, Swords is done. Uh, so yeah, like I was saying to start this episode, uh, I'm actually pretty well, uh, well, I don't know if I finished this thought, but, uh, yeah, I was looking at what games to play today, and I was just like, hmm, yeah, you know, uh, what looks good, what looks good, but, uh, yeah, I was looking at all the, uh, you know, LPs that I've been doing here lately since I've came back on YouTube, and, uh, everything's caught up, so I was just like, you know what, you know what sounds fun? How about we play some GX Duel Academy? Oh my god, it's playing the music again! start attacking. Hmm. You know, Jaden does have some earth stuff, which Gaia Power will lower his defense, so... You know what, Namobo Manga? You get in there and attack this one. Elemental Hero Clay Man! Whoa! He's got a clay body that's built to last. This card's strong enough to take on tier elements all by itself. Um... <laughs> That's a, uh, that's a joke, by the way. That's a reference to, uh, <laughs> something that happened, uh, to, uh, I think it was, uh, MBT? <laughs> there, I saw some highlight going around of, uh, <laughs> normal summon Clayman being too strong for him. Alright, let's try it again. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's try you, Morphing Jar. And yeah, I might have wasted some damage this turn, but it's okay. Spear Dragon, ah, see, see. That's why I did this, that's why I did this. Because I noticed, um, you know, two or three turns ago, he played Spear Dragon in defense mode. So I was just like, you know, that card does have zero defense, so. All right, Slight Warrior, scrape his life points off the pavement. All right, we're looking pretty good here. All right, Jaden, what you got? I did give him a brand new hand, so maybe he might throw down some polymerization. Check out this primo card, Pot of Greed. Well, I gave him seven new cards. Seven, guys. Sna ah, man, Slate Warrior is not Earth-type, is he? It's okay, I've got Sakurat's armor, but that's annoying, Jaden. All right, what else? What else are you gonna do, buddy? I'm gonna summon Luster Dragon in attack mode. Oh, dude, my Slate Warrior already had 2,400. What a waste of a summon. All right, all right. Attacking more morphing jar, huh? Oh yeah. Well check this out, Jaden. I've got a little trap of my own. Remember how you played Magic Cylinder? Try this on. It's a brand new suit of armor. Sakuretsu armor sends your monster to the graveyard. When it attacks. Oh no face downs. Oh oh oh. Oh, oh I drew my snatch deal. Yeah, how about that, Jaden? How about that? Um well, looks like we win. Um, let's see. Goblin Attack Force is in the graveyard. Yeah, that is a lot of extra damage. Let me do some math here. Let me do some math, because we're trying to get as much damage as possible. Okay, so I can get him now to 22 with Nimble Manga. Hmm. No, wait, 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 wait. Okay, 23. Ooh, this is good. This is good. Okay. 12 plus 23 is, uh, 35. Okay, okay, we've got it, guys. I've got a way to do a nice little bunch of extra damage. All right, Steamroy, get trucking for his life points. All right. Oh, but it is, Jaden. Now, Morphing Jar, Jar Smash Attack. No, 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 not yet, not yet. All right, Jaden, now I've got a little special trap just for you. Go, Spiritual Earth Art, Kurigami. By tributing one earth monster, well then, I'm allowed to revive a different one in my graveyard, and I choose the goblin attack force that I discarded with Morphing Jar. And thanks to Gaia Power, it's got 2,800 points. Go guys, club beatdown. <laughs> hey, nice move. Game over. All right, 512, nice, nice. Four monsters destroyed in battle and 10,600, good. Dope, I lost. Thanks for every duelist. Yeah, okay, Jay. All right, Friday. Who is this? Bastion Misawa. Let's do it, buddy. Look, I put my heart and soul in these six decks. Alrighty. 
Let's do it, Bastion. Uh, we'll go first. But yeah, yeah. I, uh, basically, all my other series are caught up, you know, that I've started since coming back. So I was just like, you know what? Duel Academy seems fun. Uh, there, are, there actually is, uh, you know, like two or three, like really, 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 really old series uh, that I thought about playing. Uh, namely, uh, Pokemon Emerald Randomizer. Um, there's also the Quick Play series of Donna Destiny. <laughs> but I just did the finale for the main series, so I'm like, you know what? Eh, nah, you know, not right now. But, uh, yeah, once I do feel like playing Dawn of Destiny again, which will probably happen soon, uh, I'll probably return to the Quick Play series first, and then, uh, yeah. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, so much for that being a Quick Play series, I don't know. That's my bad. But, uh, oh, it could have been. But then I'll go back to the, uh, point we were in the story. Sinister Snake, come on, return to my hand. Hmm, we got seven tools, so maybe maybe I should avoid the torrential and just regular attack. Go, Spear Dragon, Drill Peck Attack. Oh, you're gonna take some damage here, buddy. Yeah, you're gonna mill five cards, but uh, hmm, okay. And actually, he might be inclined to attack Spear Dragon, so I'm actually not gonna set seven tools. Uh, let's go with. Hmm, we'll set Steamroid. Yeah, Steamroids got good defense. Okay, your turn, Bastion. What you got? My closest mini, the Force Radar. Yeah, that is a pretty solid card. Don't attack my face down. Okay, okay, good. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, did you calculate this, Bastion? Whenever you attack, you set off my trap. Calamity of the Wicked will destroy all your spells and traps. Ha! Ah, now that back row's looking nice and clean. Let's see what I destroyed, Bastion. Ah, trap hole. Good, good, good. I made the right move not to summon. Now I flip summon Steamroy. All right. Now I'll set two cards face down for you, Bastion. And I'll also summon... Goblin attack. Oh, I did not mean to set that. Oh, well, it's okay, guys. We got Compulse to protect it and Steamroy. So, no worries, no worries. I just missed on a bit of damage. That's, that's my bad. All right, Steamroid, get a trucking on his life points. I should reanalyze my formulas. Yeah, you should, Bastion. <laughs> All right. Nope. Don't play Compulse. Nope. Don't attack, don't attack, don't attack. Good, 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 good. I was hoping he fold. I was hoping he fold. Only one face down. I'm not scared. We've got seven tools of the bandit. All right, stick go. Okay, we don't really need that yet. Uh, let's summon... Ooh, actually, we're going to set Penguin Soldier main phase two. But we're, we're going to attack first, you know, just in case he has a... Oh. Trap hole, huh? Well, how about I play this, Bastion? Uh, what's funny is I could play Compulse to save my Goblin Attack Force here. Nah, we'll save Compulse because I'm sure, I'm sure he'll be inclined to attack Goblin Attack Force once it's uh, in defense mode, so... If he doesn't destroy it with some kind of effect, that is. Okay, but that was an interesting idea, you know. That's why Compulse is good. Compulse can uh, let you avoid traps like that. Uh, Force Raider. Ooh, wait. Why didn't you attack Steamroid, bro? Or at least try to. Like, what? Why would you Why would you ever set Force Raider in defense mode like that? That, that wasn't too smart, Bastion. That wasn't too smart. You should reanalyze your formulas and, like, I don't know, you should play a lot better than that. If nothing else, you could have tried to destroy Steamroid. I mean, I know I have a trap, but, like, dude, what are you thinking? We're winning a duel. We're winning a duel. Yeah. We're winning a duel. We're winning a duel. There we go. Let's turn that up. Oh, setting, huh? Big mistake. Big mistake, buddy. Let's check this out. Ooh! <laughs> Ooh, this duel's over, Bastion. Check it out. I activate Kaya Power. This boosts the power of all my Earth monsters by 500 points. And now, I'm gonna return your monster to your hand. Penguin Soldier, go. So I'll return this monster to your hand. And that's it. 
now I'll show you what I had face down this whole time, Bastion. Compulsory evacuation device will return Goblin Attack Force to my hand, meaning I can summon it once again. Alright, go Steamroid, give us life points of trucking. Alright, Penguin Soldier, spinning turbo top Penguin Sword Attack. Yeah! Wild Flood. All right, boys, give them a thrashing with those clubs. Is my deck flawed? Game over. All right, let me get it. Ooh, 446, not bad. I probably could have finished that faster and gotten more points <laughs> if I hadn't accidentally set Goblin Attack Force. I learned a lot in this duel. Yeah, yeah. All right, Jaden, you're next. Hey, glad you showed up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's time to duel you again, Jaden. Get your game on. Alrighty. Yeah, this Earth deck's pretty good. I I'm liking how the Earth deck is performing so far. Oh yeah, what time is it? Okay, 7.04. Duel! Alright, Amazon Swords one is good. Gear free. Mobius. I like Mobius. Uh, ooh, Rising Energy. Hmm. Okay, we'll set this. Yeah, this is kind of a new card I'm, I'm trying in this deck. Check this out. Get, just discard a card, increase the attack of one face-up monster on the field by 1,500 points till the end phase. Pretty good. Also, like, look at the artwork. <laughs> this guy looks like he's about to go Super Saiyan or something. <laughs> uh, okay, and my turn. Dwayne, Jaden, get your game on. It's my turn. I draw. Oops. Uh, no, 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 no. Let's wait till he attacks. No. Scraper. You know what? We might need Rising Energy here, actually. Is he going to be aggressive with it? I summon Elemental Hero Burstinatrix in attack mode. Alright, alright. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Uh huh. Sorry, Flood. My Elemental Hero is going to attack Gearfree the Iron Knight. Oh, really? Uh huh. Wait for it, wait for it. Damage step. Damage step. Kill. Rising Energy. Hehehe, <laughs> Jaden. All right, and we'll discard, uh, we'll discard Amazon Swordswoman. And now my gear freeze points increased by 1,500. Looks like your Bursina tricks just ran into a steel wall. <laughs> yeah, you like that, Jaden? All right, so I've got options. I could uh, summon Mobius and get rid of that skyscraper, or since his life points are wide open, I can do this. Goblin attack force in attack mode, and uh, we'll play swords to protect goblin attack force. Yeah. All right, Jaden, take this. Iron sword attack. All right, boys, do your thing. Use those clubs. Oh, that's a pretty good card. Hey, that gets rid of your skyscraper. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. In defense mode, push off. I see that face down, too. I see that face down. All right, Jaden. I've got a little something special for your face down. I tribute Goblin Attack Force to summon Mobius the Frost Monarch. And he's going to ice over that face down with his special ability, Frost Glacier Freeze. What was it? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like your mirror force has been turned to ice and has been shattered. Now, Jaden, get ready. Uh, what if he has Clay Man? Go, Mobius, attack his face down. Frost Glacier Freeze. <laughs> oh, I called that Clay Man. I freaking called it. I freaking called it. Gear Free, go. Iron Sword Attack. Man, dude, I am so good. <laughs> down to a thousand light points, Jaden. Now what? <laughs> oh, oh, that mirror force got owned, bro. Uh, another face down. Well, I'm not scared now. Your mirror force is gone. All right, let's just attack. Mobius. No, wait, no, wait. He already wasted this clay man. Go, Gear Free. That's probably another weak hero monster. Destroy it. Uh, magic cylinder? Oh, negate his egg. Ah, okay, okay. Fair play, Jaden. You bought yourself one turn. You bought yourself one turn. Uh, I will set Seymour. All right, Jaden. I end my turn. 
you got, Jaden? What you got? Hain Hain. That's not a hero card. But if you set any more back row, what? What are you doing? You're attacking with a monster that has 450. You just lost. You just lost. You... What? Jaden. Oh, buddy. <laughs> oh man. Wow. Uh. I didn't see that coming. Don't I lost. Yeah, what are you doing attacking with Hain Hain, bro? Oh my god. <laughs> That's a first. That's a first. I don't think we've ever won, you know, that way. Oh my god, Jay. What is your problem, bro? Alright, Cyrus, you're up. Get your game on, get your game on. Yeah. It's flood. I wasn't. Yeah. Oh man, that's gonna be one for the highlight reel. Freaking Hain Hain running into my uh <laughs> into my steamroid like that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was awesome. Uh this has been a good day. Oh, we must draw on scapegoat. Nope. Nope. Yeah, okay, okay. Huh. Extermination. Hmm. We got some interesting stuff. Uh let's just go with Spear Dragon. And uh hmm, we got heavy storm. Set one card, Cyrus. And I am my turn. Yeah. Okay, Cyrus, don't you, don't you, don't you, don't you. Yeah. What you got, Cy? This spell card's gonna do wonder. MST. Mystical space type of. Oh, yeah? Is it gonna do wonders when I chain it? Reveal. Scapegoat. This will give me four little extra guys to protect my life points. Ha. Huh. Jabated. Injo turn, Injo turn, son. Okay, he's only got one face down. So let's go for number one of extermination here. Uh, you got a magic jammer? <laughs> magic jammer. Yeah, okay, Cy. Alright. Alright, let's see what Cyrus discarded at the graveyard here. UFO Roid. Uh, honestly, that is a good discard. Because if you get called to haunted, you can bring it back without a sacrifice. So. Okay, um, you know, some of the cards Cyrus plays are Earth. Yeah, so also, I just thought of this. Oh yeah, it can be Gaia Power. This boosts all Earth monsters by 500, including my scapegoats. So I'm gonna switch all these little guys into attack mode. All right, Spear Dragon, eliminate that face down with your Drill Peck attack. Aha! Called it on the Earth Monster. Now you take extra damage, because Gaia Power also lowers Earth Monster's defenses by 500. And wait, why didn't you attack with Steamroid? We have a Force Raider situation, guys. He's not... Okay, like, I don't know who programmed Cyrus's AI, right? But, like, at the very least, you should have programmed uh, Cy Cyrus to almost to always summon Steamroid in attack mode and always attack with it. Because, dude, that's just the best part of its effect, is, like, when you're attacking, it gains 500. If you just set it in defense, I mean, yeah, I guess it does have 1,800 defense, which is okay. But, arguably, like, you're not even taking advantage of its best effect. If you just... You, you, you know what I'm saying? I think you guys feel me on that one. Okay, he does have a face down. What if it's Mirror Force? Alright, alright, side. we'll switch one goat to defense. Okay, let's do it. Go, Spear Dragon, attack that face down. Drill Peck attack. Aw, oh, Penguin Soldier. Okay. Alright, well, I kind of feel okay about this. What? Ah, interesting play, Cyrus. He actually made the right move with um, Penguin Soldier, because I thought the AI would return this in a scapegoat to my hand. But by returning two of the sheep tokens that were in attack mode, he avoided a thousand damage. Uh, nicely done, Cyrus. I'm genuinely impressed. Like, okay, we went from a very, very wrong move in Steamroid to a very, very right move on Penguin Soldier. Yeah, I mean, because I could just resummon Spear Dragon, so you know what I'm saying? So... Pretty interesting there. Hmm. Uh, can I chain here? Okay, okay. Alright. Oh, no, 
monsters. Um, well, we just won. Let's make sure no funny stuff happens. Okay, I'm gonna bait seven tools. Okay, Metal Morph to Spear Dragon. Ha ha ha, I knew it, I knew it. I don't think so. Seven tools of the bandit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now there's only one face down. Okay, go, Heavy Storm. You used MST, Mystical Space Typhoon. I'm showing you a card that's better, Trap Bowl. That would have got my Mobius out of the game. Okay, Spear Dragon go. Let's flip summon Slate Warrior. All right. And with my Gaia power gone, I'll switch my scapegoat back to defense. All right, and just for the extra damage, I'll tribute my Spear Dragon to summon Mobius. All right, Sai, I win. Go, Slate Warrior. Scrape his life points off the pavement. <laughs> That wasn't very nice. Oh yeah, check this out. Frost Glacier Freeze. That's it, Sai. Oh man. Game over. All right, 384, not bad, not bad. Yeah, he lost. There's only could beat a fiery duelist. Darn right, I'm too fiery for you. Okay, Saturday. Where should I go today? Um, Let's see. I think the main person I'll focus on the weekends here is Chaz because, uh, yeah, I, I haven't really been dueling Chaz at all because he just wouldn't duel us for the longest time. So let's see if Chaz is available. If not, we'll just go to the shop and uh, pick up some weekend packs. So, okay, I don't see Chaz anywhere, so I'm sorry, the Chaz. Oh, uh, yeah, so let's just head to the shop here. Uh, let's go see Sadie. Hi, Sadie. Come on in. Oh, we have a lot of points. 75, 33. Holy crap. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, let's... You know, I haven't been getting anything else except for this. Let's get some dragons in flight. Maybe we can build a new deck. Um, let's just buy... Whoops, whoops, whoops. Let's buy, like... Let's buy five to start. And I will buy like two, because we do want the other Mobius. Live vehicles. Why is this 400 EV? Holy crap. Uh, I'll buy like one of this. Yeah. And then we'll buy, we'll buy a little bit of everything. So one of this, one of this, one of this, one of this, no, two of this, a couple of these. Uh, oh, these are 150. Uh, one of these, two of these. Uh, 150, one of these, one of these, one of these, one of these, three, four of these. I don't think we've gotten someone's skull yet. And two of these. And Pyrogen, I really don't use Pyro Monsters that much, but these are only available on the weekends, so I'll buy two of these. Okay, that's it for now. Let's see if anything good comes out of that Dragon Pack. Okay, I don't expect anything too much from this one. Uh, Sparks. Ooh, Curse of Dragon is not bad. Okay. Summon Skull Pack. Okay. Um, Giant Soldier Stone is pretty solid. Uh, Grave Digger Pool is interesting. Ground Attacker Bug Rock has helped us in Duels of the Roses a lot of times. Not so good here. Uh, Nimbo Mamong is good, but we've already got plenty of that, so... Uh, ooh, Fire uh, Princess. Can make some interesting burn decks with that. If I get enough heal cards, Amazon Swords is good. Tribe Infecting Virus is good. Um, Granador is pretty good. Mephist, the Infernal General. It's an interesting card. It's kind of like Parshath, but it, you know, discards from your opponent's hand instead of Mask of Darkness is good, instead of uh, drawing you a card. Um, personally, I prefer Air Knight Parshan, but, eh, you know, that's just me. If you're going to tribute for that kind of effect. You know what I mean? I think we got another Megamorph, too, by the way. Uh, scapegoat. Good. You know, maybe I should consider putting Megamorph in my deck because, you know, if you get the quick finish bonus, but then again... How would that work? Because we would need Mega Morph. We would need our life points to be lower. And then quick finish bonus, you know what I mean? Yeah, maybe not. Hmm. Self-destruct button is a funny idea. I, I might play self a self uh play that. Did we get limiter removal? If 
Mobius, Mobius. Okay, did, are we gonna get Mobius? Mobius is what I'm looking for. Oh! Uh, we did get seven color fish, which is all of that. Okay, yeah, let's get this dragon of the flight. Blue Eyes Tomb Dragon. Okay, Burst Stream of Destruction. Element Dragon. Hmm. Element Dragon again. Ooh, Red Eyes Darkness Dragon. Did we get Luster Dragon? Regular Luster Dragon? Ooh, another one. Okay, and Troop Dragon. Ah, some interesting stuff out of there. Kotatsu Lava Golem. Hmm, interesting card. Interesting card. Yamada Dragon, too. Wow. Okay, so let's take a look at some of the stuff we got. Wow. A lot of stuff. Um, anything new out of here? Yeah, uh, we're at 95%. I think one of the cards we're missing for sure is Summon Skull. And I don't know what else could be in that pack. Uh, nothing new out of here. Ooh, these two are new. Good. Wing Weaver, Curse of the Mass Beast. Uh, Amazon Swordswoman is good. And I already have one in this deck, so I might add another one. Mephist is new. Okay. Uh, anything new out of here? Not really. Wow, we only have 84% of the effect monsters? That's surprising, really. Um, but I guess I have been buying a lot of water packs. Um, okay, we got 95, 96% of the Harpy's Feather Duster. Okay, uh, nothing new out of here. Uh, oh, and this one's complete, the Seven Tools pack. Yeah, we did get limited removal. Hmm. Yeah, check this out. Double the attack of all face-up machine-type monsters. Yeah, that's kind of what I was just saying about Megamorph, about the quick finish bonus. Maybe this would be good to go for, but it's just, man, as much as I want to, 400 per pack is steep. That is a steep, steep price. And you're not guaranteed to get uh, 